John Meadows in the building. Here he is. The one you've been waiting for. <laughs> So right now we're warming up. This is an exercise that's really good for your lower lats. Um, you really drive your elbows. Sit your feet or your butt back a little. Now lean forward. Lean forward. There you go. Now drive your elbows back. Right in your hand. That's what you want right there. Sets that you do? Well, if you are 120 years old like me, you do four or five. Most people need about two, maybe three. Okay, awesome. comes up, he's going to really reach and stretch. Really stretch out his upper lat. What's the rep range on this? 8 to 10, so we'll start with 10. So every, every back workout today is going to be 8 to 10? Uh, just the first two exercises. Okay. Now reach, 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 reach. There you go. Drive your elbows down and squeeze. There we go, right there. There we go. See, he's reaching, he's stretching, he's controlling the weight, and he's flexing. Ten reps, start with. Here we go. Are you feeling bigger already? It's an illusion. It's an illusion. <laughs> well, I figure if I stand next to her and not next to John, I'll be good to go. Yeah. Good arch. She's a master at arching. See how she's arching? Her arching is allowing her to her, take her elbows back in a way that really flexes her back hard. See the nice little arch she's got in her chest? So it's like she's pushing her stomach forward? Yeah, her chest. Yeah. And then driving elbows back. It's funny on back work because 
people who naturally have good posture can train their back better because they're positioned better. Whereas people with poor posture, they pull more with their arms and not so much with their lats. It's just crazy. When you see someone really good posture, usually they, their back exercises look good. And just the opposite is true. People walk around like that. You know, so is that why you use straps the whole time so you take your arms out of the workout? Or? Kind of, yeah, I mean, your, your lats are way stronger than your biceps. So you don't want your biceps to be a limiting factor. Now, having said that, I don't like to use them until I get to the heavy sets. There's a tip for you, right? So true. dungeon we were doing some filming and we uh, shut the door right here and uh, it locked and we couldn't get out so we're pounding on the door and nobody can hear us so I'm waiting for Matt who's the owner here to come on the speaker and say hello America do you want to play a game I'm like oh my god what's gonna happen down here in the dungeon eventually somebody heard us and they kicked in the door and we got out but we're back today <laughs> so, at the same time John gets locked up in here, I get a call because I'm over at our other gym from Tim, our assistant manager here, and he calls me up and he goes, Matt, 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 we got some issues, we got some issues. I said, what's going on? He goes, well, you know, there's a guy laying on the floor, and I think he had a heart attack with an ambulance coming, but that's not the real problem. And I'm like, well, what's the real problem? He goes, John Meadows is locked in the power room. I'm like, that's more important. Then the guy in the heart attack, he's like, well, he'll be fine, but we really need to focus on getting John out. What are we going to do? <laughs> this exercise is uh, one that I make pretty popular. It's called the Meadows Row, right? You Google it or YouTube it, man, you see hundreds and hundreds of people doing this. It's really good for back thickness, just thickening up your whole back, your rhomboids, your lats, everything. Man, everyone loves it. Everyone who's down here views it. <laughs> Oh, this is a very tough exercise. Sucks the life out of you, baby, but it works. Definitely use a belt on these. And I would say anything where you're bent over, man, use a belt. Be safe. I say pop a quarter off of there. Yes. Should have brought your, should have brought your belt, you could have done a. Oh, well, you know what? Let me go grab my belt. Because okay. I ain't trying to end myself here. Late, late to the show. Had to find my belt. Looks like a girl Somebody belt. Somebody gave me, yeah, it feels like a girl belt. That's all right. Whoever sponsored this, sorry. Somebody gave me from the arm. Oh, yes. All right. All right. This leg up. Yep. There you go. Grab the row. Keep your shoulders and your torso stationary. Okay. All right. That's not bad. Yeah. There you go. Don't let any of this move. All your lats. Stretch. Okay. Elbows come back a little bit more that way. A little bit closer. Closer to your waist. There you go. Let it pull you down and stretch it more, though. Tilt your body down a little bit. There, yeah, there, right there, right there. Now, do you see how it's lat just holding up? Now, let it stretch it. Reach, 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 reach. See that? See that? See how that's holding up? Now, drive your elbow. 
Now you're coming up real high, so it's a lot of rear, rear go. It's a lot up to here. But if you keep your elbow, step forward a little bit. Watch this, I'm gonna fix it. Step forward, yep. step forward a little more. Now watch where his arm pulls up. See? Oh yeah. See? Yep. See? That's how you fix the that's how you target the area. You just move your feet forward and backward. Just the uh, left foot? Yep, well both a little bit. Now step forward a few more. Now watch. Now it's gonna come all the way down here. Now he's got a lot of he's getting heavy, isn't it? <laughs> oh yeah, good stuff. Yeah. You gotta do the other side. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, that sounds good. There you go. All right, now let's let's see. Let's right see. foot. Right there. Right there. Brace yourself with the other arm. Perfect. Right there. I want you to tilt down a little bit more. There. Right there. Right there. Good. Reach. Reach down with your left arm. Reach. There you go. Now drive your elbow up. Open up your lap by reaching. There. See that? Right there. See that? How's bam. There you go, come on. Good, come on. That's it, that's it, look at that. That's a lot of back work right there. Two more reps. One more, two, okay, that's a good first set. See, that's another reason to get your form right. You just gotta keep going until you get your form right. right. You know? yeah. do 20 reps until you get it right. Now you're talking about arched back. Um, is that pretty much every back workout you do, you want your back right? Yeah, like look at her. Look at her. Man, that's perfect. She's doing a regular key bar girl, obviously, but that's textbook form right there. Completely flat lower back and driving her elbows. Chest is arched. That's a lot of rhomboid and upper back. Very good. Ooh. Right there. Now lock your arms right there. No triceps. I don't want triceps. Okay. Come on, come on. Lock them? Yeah, now lock your arm like that and pull okay. with this. And then we come up to the top of your head. All lats. No, no, you're doing triceps. Come okay. back up. Come back up. Straighten your arms all the way. Straighten your arms out. Completely. Now get a little bend. Right. Little bend down. Now lock them. Don't let them move. Do all the pulling with this. Perfect, 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 perfect. Back up. That's it. That's it. Only come up to the top of your head. Okay. Do it again. Do it again, come on. Up. Uh, yeah, that's why I go a little lighter on these. Oh yeah. All lats. Pull with this right here. Oh, yeah, I feel shit popping. Come on. Come on. That's, I think we're going to lighten up. Okay, but don't, don't do triceps, man. Okay. Come on. Don't bend your arms. Lock your arms and pull with your lats. Pull with your lat now. Lat, lat, lat. There you go, right there. Fight through it. That's it, come on. No triceps. Lats. Lats. Oh, you, you gotta isolate. Think hard as hell, huh? Yeah. What is there? Till you get used to it. Yep. Back up. No, no triceps. Lats. There we go. One more. Up. Okay. Maybe a little <laughs> I, see people, I see people do these on uh, chest day all the time. Is that is now? If you're doing chest, I would change the form. Okay, so just different form for chest. Yeah, day. if we were doing chest, instead of stopping at the head, I would have him pull up further and flex his chest when he's doing it. Okay. Here comes the pro. Here comes the technique champion. See how her arms are locked? Yeah. See, her arms aren't budging. Right. They slide in and wrap those in her lock. All the pull ons come from here. See right there? I don't think that's part of that either. She just does on her own. Good. Good right there. Perfect. Excellent. All lats. The biggest thing with these is when people get to the bottom, they want to bend their arms and use their triceps. And that takes the tension off the lats.
this is a good example of an exercise where I'm in a stick or a form. Because you know, I really get the benefit out of it, you have to do it perfect. Right. And what was the reason you, you uh, lay a, a on the bench long ways instead of just your back on it? I feel like you can get more of a stretch when you're laying across it. I think there's a limiting factor in your abdominal, your abs, your rib cage, and on that. You can only go so low. But uh, I just feel like you can get a more natural stretch from these laying this way on the bench. What I tell people is just experiment. Try it both ways and see what works best for you. Most of the people I work with, this is what works best for them. Ooh. Okay, baby. Super strength. I'm saying that. <laughs> I can do a set of 30. Yeah. <laughs> With one hand. I was going to say, I got, I got some pictures of you doing pull ups, staying in a pull position here. I like these. These are absolutely awesome for your spinal directors. And, you know, uh, when you compete or when you're walking around the beach, it's pretty manly to have those big, thick spinal directors on your lower back. It's just a real badass looking muscle. So uh, we started doing these at Louis, Louis Simmons, who invented these. Uh, we started doing these in the mid 90s the west side phenomenal lower back exercise i just see people swinging the weight just don't swing the weight control the weight. <clears throat> control the weight. As long as we don't start swinging it, we'll keep going up. Pressure is on you. As long as you don't swing. And you get the load that thing all the way out to the end with the weight if you want to swing. Now keep my legs apart? Put them together. Okay. If you want to keep your legs apart, it's more glute, but we're working with spinal erectors. Don't bend your legs, no leg curl, not an egg curl. Right there, right there, good, excellent. Thank you. Now here's where I want you to feel the contraction. Right there. Nice and slow, nice and slow. Good. Good. Almost there. So you don't want to go pipe, you don't want to use whatever, you go to parallel? Yeah, just keep your legs, come up parallel to your back. You don't want to create that huge lordotic arch at the top. I'm going to have to Google what that means. Lordosis. <laughs> okay. Like that? <laughs> so you, 
when you come up for a while, it's kind of crazy. Gotcha. 